Cotto Joe with Webs Photography. I'm here to teach you multiplicity photography. We're going to do four shots for our multiplicity photography picture. We're going to put all four shots into one picture. And I'm going to call this video Multiplicity Photography The Missing Link. Alright, these are the things you'll need. You'll need a camera. To can be any kind of camera a shutter release you don't have to have a shutter release you can set the self timer on your camera or use an assistant to push the shutter button for you you will need a tripod I'm at in aperture mode you have manual aperture shutter priority and auto so I'm shooting in aperture priority I'm at F F20 at 1 50th of a second shutter speed and, and ISO's 100 like I said I have a 10 second timer so I'm using a 18 to 55 millimeter lens so let's get started okay we're going to start taking our four shots now I do four different poses and I'm with, like I said this is multiplicity the missing link. Last time I shot this video I had a gap in it so I wanted to redo it and like I said I wanted to go over the settings and the things that you need to do this kind of photography. So let's start taking pictures. Right, now that we have our four shots we're go going to go back to the computer and I'm going to show you how I edit these and put them all into one photo okay here we are at the computer so what we're going to do now is we're going to go to Photoshop open up Photoshop and then we're going to come up here to file and then we're going to go come here to script and after we highlight script we're going to slide over and come down to load and to stack okay now we're going to come here to browse click browse we're going to find our folder I pulled these off the memory card that we're going to load these four pictures into Photoshop. This is the same practice that you would do if you're 
uploading them directly from your memory card and click OK. What I did there instead of click, I just highlighted every one of them because we're going to load them all together and then I'm going to hit OK. Now we have our four pictures in here. Now we're going to hit OK. Wait for them to load. Alright, now that they're loaded, we're going to come over here. I don't know if you can see my mouse, but I'm over here. And then we're going to click on that top one. We're going to come down here and click Add Layer Mask. We're going to come to the second one, Add Layer Mask. Third one, Add Layer Mask. Fourth one. Add layer mask. Now we're going to come back up here to the top one and we're going to click on the layer mask that we just added. Now that this is white, we want to make sure our brush is black. So let's go up here to our brush. I'm going to change the size just a little bit. That should be about right. We're going to erase the first picture. Kind of go over it a couple times, make sure you got everything. Okay, now we're still clicked on this one, so we're going to hit Control I. Okay, now we're going to click down here on the second picture on the layer mask. Now we're going to erase. Okay, we're still clicked on that one, on the layer mask on number two. So we're going to hit Control I. Now we're going to click on number three, layer mask, the white box. I'm going to erase. So click on number three layer mask, control I. Now what we're going to do, now that we have them all on there, we're going to come up here to layers, and we're going to come down to flatten image. Flatten image. Click that. All right, now I'm gonna add my watermark to this. So I'm gonna go back up to the brush. Yeah, we'll leave it as black. All right, now we're gonna save it. We're gonna go to File, Save As,
save to my computer. We're going to find our file called Multiplicity Photography. There it is. Save. JPEG. JPEG you can use on um, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. If this video was helpful and you liked it, please hit the like button, share it, and subscribe for more videos. I'm eventually going to do a video on how to make your own watermark brush so that you can stamp it on all your photos. You can change the colors and all that. So that's for another day. Thank you. God bless. And don't forget to subscribe and share. Thank you.